Okay, everyone, we are taking a first look at the Sable demo. Uh, this is one of the idea Xbox games. We are playing on Xbox Series X. Um, did I say Sable demo? I meant Sable demo. So like Xbox did last year, um, they are releasing a lot of the E3 demos on the Xbox store that you get to try for a limited time. Uh, so I thought I'll quickly have a look at this demo and go through this demo here. Uh, I didn't even know much about this game at all. I saw it on the, I saw it on the Summer Games Fest presentation. I was like, wow, this looks super interesting. We should check this out. So when it, when it was like those idea Xbox game demos and you could got one week to try it for, let's do it. Um, there's no audio here at the moment because unfortunately this has a licensed soundtrack is by Japanese Breakfast, I believe the band is called. Uh, I was speaking to the devs earlier on. They said that they think it's okay to stream this um, and you should be fine. Uh, but this is a Sony licensed band and Sony, you know, famously hits his own games down. So I'm not going to take the risk. The unfortunate bit here is um, the music is like super important to this game because think of this as a... Um, uh, like, I don't know if you've played Journey, but like uh, you explore sand dunes in this cool art style where there's uh, chill, re relaxing music playing in the background. The music is super important to this, uh, like the, the atmosphere it sets. So unfortunately, we're going to have to turn it off here. So just keep that in mind. Um, probably watch, out, watch some trailers to, if you are curious about the type of music that is going to be here. Uh, so yeah, we'll take a first like 40, 50 minute look at this to see what it is. Uh, what um, drew me to this was like the graphic style. It reminds me kind of like those, I want to say 90s French cartoons, Tintin and things like that. Uh, I don't know if that's relevant now because nobody knows what Tintin is. They've probably watched that new version, uh, but it's got it's like super interesting look. Uh, so that's what um, caught my attention here. So I thought, let's check this out. Uh, but apparently it's been, this has been on everybody's radar. Everybody knows about it. Uh, just I didn't. So let me quickly go in here. Uh, if we just quickly have a look at settings. And let me turn off the music. Um, keep in mind, this is, like the, this is like the E3 demos that would have been shown on the floor, right? Well, that's how Idea Xbox uh, promotes these. Uh, so there will be like like bugs and glitches. Uh, here so uh keep like just keep that in mind this isn't a finished product or anything um this is like kind of like what you would be playing on the air quote show floor if you was at e3 i think that's what they're going for here um I play like two minutes of this like off stream. I know there's like music that starts here. Move towards a wall, begin climbing, keep an eye on the stamina. Okay. On your stamina. I don't know why I keep saying the. On all my uh first looks today. Um we will be covering a few more idea Xbox games. I'll go up on, over on Twitch and YouTube, so keep an eye out for those. Crouch, okay. I know how it feels right now to be this hot because I'm streaming this in the middle of summer and I had to turn off my room fan Pre hold b to sprint did it say i have to turn off my room fan because i don't want it to get want you to hear it in the capture i know how it feels it's so hot i also have to ask my twitch chat we good for audio twitch chat as you can see interesting look right uh, so they just announced about the Japanese breakfast. I wonder if that was in the plans all along or like, because I've just found out about this game, uh, because 
Japanese breakfast came into popularity recently, right? And it's just now that people know. Oh, no, that's the band from the game. Um, I'm not sure. I should probably go look back at some like older trailers. Um, see which came first, right? Japanese breakfast popularity or uh, they added them once they became popular. I can feel... Shaddy smiling behind her mask, just as I know she can feel the teeth bearing little grimace behind mine. Okay. I'm nervous and she's softly, sweetly amused. In her eyes, I probably have very little to worry about. You know, you have nothing to worry about, don't you? Stable? And yet, I know, I know, I'm not worried. Alright, okay. I tell her I'm not worried at all, and it's possible, possibly the least convincing I've ever been. Oh, is it like I'm monologuing this in my head? I don't know how you are. You're going to be nervous until you've started, and then you'll act like you've been doing it your whole life. What were we talking about? Remember the first time you rode a bike? Motorbike? Give us motorbikes for the game. Uh, you wouldn't even let me put you on the seat. You were so afraid. Your hands were like little claws gripping onto me. Okay. Fingers and fingers. Got it. Got down. Hey, okay, I remember thinking. he reaches out and places his hands on the edge of my mask. Oh, I wonder if this is, um, I wonder if this is monologuing or I wonder if this is a, um, uh, like a subtitle option. You need to talk to Hilal and Driss. Driss should already have made the arrangements for your bike and Hilal will share something. Well, let's say as useful as it is. I think I might suspect that Jaddy saying, but I'll stay quiet after that. Hey, but don't go planning your return. Before you've even left, take all your time you need. It's a big decision making out there. Hey. Okay. All right, got it. A compass. Perfectly weighted. Thank you. Uh, LB to compass. Okay. Up here. What was to run? B. What's up? Take this. Gliding. Wait. The. Gliding stone, what do you give me? Can't leave without it. Do, uh, is this got like a Breath of the Wild glide mechanic? Take it to the temple runes with it to activate, okay. Okay. Get a bike. Wait, is 
Is that like technology? Logging in? Wait, huh? Wonder what the time period is of this. <coughs> Excuse me. I get my bike first or does it want me to I feel like it said get your bike first before you set out what if I can change Hi, I came for a bike. I was, I was, oh, do you have something special for me? Let's just get to the point. Your bike? Yeah, my bike. Yes, yes, of course, right? A tutorial? Learning experience. Don't fall off. When you're not riding it, your hover bike will appear as icon. Da, 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 something, 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 something. Uh, accelerate, ride the sandcar, strafe, steer. Get off. Hey. has got two modes if i go into strafe then you know obviously you can strafe i really love the look of this game it's just Bike in danger. All right, can I take the bike to the other quest now? 
then change Thing is so slow. Oh my god, a bike. Is that like a nut? Activate the guys. All right, fine. Maybe I should have. if running would have been faster You can make it. You can make it. You can make it. So it seems like he's barring the climbing from us, uh, Breath of the Wild. Uh oh, we're, we're straight stuck. Like the stamina bar and everything. This is like a literal, uh, like a hand glider. I was gonna say, oh, the bike is different, but then the bike is the DLC. Uh oh. Oh, thank God there's no fall damage. But the bike is DLC in Breath of the Wild, also. I wonder if it would work better, uh, better if there was like bubbles, speech bubbles, or type of speech bubble, thought bubble over your head to describe like your feelings and stuff. I wonder if this is because there should be music here, and that's what. It probably is. There was probably music here because I feel like there's missing. Boss fight. Two boss fights. I mean, that's the risk if game publishers, indie or not, want to use licensed music, right? These days and coverage, like, what can you really do, you know? Even if they say, yeah, we give you permission, licensed music in such a weird place that anybody can hit the video and claim the video. So, like, most content creators on YouTube and Twitch, press A and hold to glide in midair. Everybody would avoid that, you know? So... Oh, but at least it's not a, a um, you know, piece of cloth. I 
I, I bet they thought, well, that's probably going to be a bit too on the nose, right? If we... Oh, I'm, I'm definitely not going to make it up. Sorry, was I saying that would probably be a bit too on the nose if they um, just use the piece of cloth that you glide from, right? I mean, they did it in Immortals Phoenix Rising. Am I going to have to go right back? Out to the. I f uh oh, I feel like I'm out to do this. I'm not even sure now. Um, stuck. I mean, I haven't got enough stamina to actually. I don't think I have. Maybe the devs were like, well, nobody's going to fail this first section. They, they don't know about my gaming skills. I was just creating artificial tension. I mean, I don't know if this is Zelda like or whatever. So, but if uh, if this is anything Zelda like in this art style, this would be kind of cool. But it seems like we haven't got a stamina bar for. Full damage. Yeah. I think this is a. This is a two-person dev team? I was trying to get some information on the game beforehand. And it goes to their site and it just seems like two... I, that's why I'm forward-facing at least two primary people. Don't quote me on that though. I'm not 100% sure. Keep thinking I can, um, that's gonna build up my stamina. Keep thinking I can breath of the wild, like, you know, jump and I have something for you. How does it feel? I mean, you know, 
Ik zei eigenlijk true freedom. Safe like a warm hug. I'm gonna go queasy. I mean, I don't know about the writing here. It's like not really engaging me. Power. There go. There you go. Thank you. That's not what I'm trying to do. Come on. Let go. Let, let go. Definitely has that Assassin's Creed. You cling on to the wrong thing and don't cling on to the thing you want, kind of. Better now that I'm getting the bike right answer. Of course, I go get it. I'm going to make my own hover bike. Build you, of course. Make waypoints, got it. Uh, our bikes are reborn. The ruined ships is fragments spread apart. Onion rock, another behind the old. Uh, hey, bike R to navigate. Press RB to use navigator to mark interesting landmarks to appear on your compass. You can also add and remove marks on the map screen. Try your. Pl uh, Placing markers, okay. Uh, wait, I've got to do it on this screen? Move cursor. No, that... Uh, wait, really? There's got to be another screen or something, right? That is, um, that's not a good way to place marks. Like either zoom out or even give us the first person view of, uh, Phoenix. Wait, was it Phoenix rising or Zelda gave us the first person? Zelda gave us the first person view, right? Uh, that's just kind of cumbersome. Okay, 
Let's go find these parts. Should have probably took on my bike, but uh, maybe I should have actually. This might take too long. The, like the dune stuff and how you're going to build your bike. And I'm definitely getting like a Star Wars pod racer vibe, right? I wonder if they borrowed from that. That was their inspiration. Where'd it go? Totally lost. Where's my mark? really pointing out like the popping and stuff and uh, I, mean, I don't know if popping is the right word again because it is a demo right also small studio uh, hmm I uh, feel like I've messed something up here Maybe I was meant to go to that other task before coming here, but I feel like... Alright, so something's up perfectly round hard rock, da da da, alright. Am I just blind? There was another way here. By the way, I came. Oh, wait, is that it? Hold on. Probably not. It's not going to be just in a container. I get that it wants me to use like this compass marking thing, but I, I don't want to use it. It's horrible to use. It's just like, no, like what? No. Oh, maybe I placed the mark and I went to the mark and that's what's going on here. I just literally came to the wrong area. 
Oh, uh, maybe that's what it was. What it was. I mean, devs, if you're listening, you probably turn that into like first person or zoom out or something because. Hey, I don't think that's uh... I, I When I glided past that person, I was like, oh, I don't need to talk to them. Let me go do the mission. And now I'm like, oh, I should probably go back and talk to them. Also, it's making me realize is like how important the music is to this. I'm probably doing this a disservice by playing it without the music. Unfortunately. But you know, I'm not about to risk regardless of what Sony says, Sony music says. I hear Sony music and I'm like, nope. I said, I don't see a written authorization somewhere. I'm not touching that soundtrack with a barge ball. Would it be funny if I glided to that person? They would say, oh, I found a better way for you to mark stuff. Maybe it is actually. There's, like Somebody gives me a pair of binoculars that makes it easier. My... Idiot soft just haven't found it. Yeah, uh, any tips? Because I'm kind of like, you know, I wasn't paying attention to what you said the first time. I'm going to be honest with you. And that was the wrong button. And now I can't remember what you said was where and what. Stop. I would love my. Oh, okay. Maybe this makes it. Okay. Well, I guess if we get a map, that will make marking easier because it will load the map. Oh, that answers that question. We get a map. The map makes it easier. Probably should have gave us the map before you gave us the compass, right? I mean, and I can't remember what he said for the parts now. I, I, need, I need some cuts. Some deep cuts. Ha ha. Ha. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, I know the value of money. Uh huh. Oh wait, maybe she gives me more tips. Oh, I X through that a couple of times. All right. Okay. Okay. Bye. 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 Yeah, we got like 50 minutes to show this off. I don't want to waste everybody's time. Everybody in my chat is like, "What? That's never stopped you before." Shut up, chat.
Deep cuts. I mean, I had pl I had a lot. Wait, how do we? Did I buy it? Uh, how do I use the map? Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Then you can add, add markers now? Okay. That makes way more sense. Because I was like, that would be a horrible way to, um, you know, mark. It seems like we'll probably get clothing upgrades. These quest items. Uh, bike parts. Oh, maybe we get more upgraded bike parts. We change child mass. I wonder if mass gives us abilities or anything. Okay, now my memory. Where could those parts be? If I only knew... I guess this gives us a good gist of the game, right? And uh, what it does, the game does say that, or the description does say that, you know, you use your hover by a lot. So this is gonna be a core concept of getting around. Kind of curious to see how much there is here, like past this bit, or is it just gonna be this first? Probably tutorial like area. This looks like a place there might be some bike parts. I have to scavenge from old ships or something, something, something it said, right? Maybe I would have added more animation into the run animation. Like that's something you do right at the start, right? So they did that purposely. Uh, because the world moves slow and like the the run animation is, is purposely purposefully lacking. I wonder if it would have looked better with uh, like more animation frames. I guess they couldn't have made the like when you're panning the world judder and have less animation frames, right? Because then that would have probably made everybody queasy. So that was the right choice not to do that. Okay, also, I should have been paying attention to... What do you got for me? The empty? Should have been paying attention to what moved. I was just like... I think that opened?
I'm so clever, chat. I know. I didn't even need a tutorial for that. I swear I haven't played this game before. And we got the control panel. Yay. There's a shortcut out of here. Probably shortcut out of here. Shortcut out of here. Hi, shortcut out of here. Uh, did I just clip through the world? Probably. One part down, two to go. Also, we gotta call it somewhere. I don't want this um, first look of this demo to go on forever, right? Uh, probably gives you a good gist of it. Like, like I said, the only thing you're not experiencing from this is the music, uh, which I will 100% admit is a core part to this. Uh, so it does take away a lot. Uh, you can't hear it uh, um you know gliding driver by crown like very you can see what games it borrows from uh but it's definitely going for a look artistic look and art style look and art style same thing you know what i mean um that separates it from those other I kind of want to get these parts of my bike to see how fast the actual, you know, not a broken down bike goes. Uh, I'm assuming the proper bike would be like way faster than this because this is so slow. It's just like almost annoying to drive. Uh, yeah, but there you have it. That was a first look at Sable. You're playing the id at xbox e3 demo uh this comes out i think around september this is also gonna be on game pass day one i believe when it drops not sure what other platforms it's coming to keep an eye on it uh, if you are interested in what type of music is gonna be in it i'm sure you can look up uh some trailers of this and uh, japanese breakfast to know like the smooth soothing style is going for this will be going up as a highlight over on Twitch and YouTube. If you're watching on Twitch or YouTube, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought. Uh, don't forget to drop a like if you like the video. Uh, subscribe and follow depending on where you're watching. And turn those notification bells on so you do know when, nobody, do know when new videos drop. I stream a couple times a week over on Twitch. Welcome community Discord and a personal tour all the time. All that information will also be in the description. Come check us out. Uh, once again, don't forget to there will be a couple more ID at Xbox free demos that we'll be covering so keep an eye out for those anyway we're gonna call it with this one much love peace